Zurkiru kind of explain Sura chapter 17, verse 14. I was like, I'm not sure if I'm watching. Okula in San Elzemna, who Taira, who Vianoki, one of the Jule who Yo Malaya, Matikitab and Yelka, who Monshura. Yes. Could you kind of explain this verse? The literal translation is that we have made to hang by the neck of every man, every person his bird and on the day of judgment a book will emerge from that open book in which man will read what he has been doing right what is the verse uh, his bird literal translation is fi unqihi wa nukhrijo lahu yawm al qiyamati kitaban yalqahu manshura and every man's works here the translation is not literal i'm talking of literal translation it should be and every man's bird is fastened onto his neck and on the day of resurrection we shall bring out from it or him a book which he will find wide open right now the bird the word tire is in fact the key word which should be understood before we understand the meaning of this verse the word Tire hair is uh, used in a well known Arabic expression which means ill omen or omen. For omen, take omen, the word tire is used. Yeah. Where? Yeah. Where out? <laughs> so when you speak of somebody's luck, when you speak of somebody's being uh, blessed or cursed, you talk in these terms. He will just quote the right verse, which I don't remember where it is, but I have told him he will find out from the key. Uh -huh. The people who are hostile to the prophets, addressing them, they say that we take bad omen from you, or we understand you bring us a luck. And the same word tair is used in the verbal form to indicate ill luck. So it can be ill luck, ill luck or good luck. The answer to this is given by the Holy Quran that it is your tair which is with you. It is not our tair which is creating trouble or bringing bad days for you. Right? Oh. This is the word tair, which is given a, a form, a verbal form, in a certain bab or major of Arabic. Right? The proof that is the same word tire which is used is found in the following verse. Kalu tairukum maakum. See? <laughs> the prophets of Allah who were thus taunted by the people to whom they were sent, they replied, Tairukum maakum. Your tire is with you. So tire means luck or omen or the conduct of a person, of a people. So Tairuku means the book of your conduct, the record of your conduct is with you. It is this which is bringing you ill luck, not uh, the coming of prophets or the, uh, you know, basis of a bia, as they call it. So there the word Tair means exactly this. 
every man's record of what he has been doing, every man's record of his good deeds or bad deeds is made, is made to fasten by his neck or made to hang by his neck, which means neck is the symbol of life. And this is why the Holy Quran says that he is nearer to people than their uh, 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 jugular vein or Habl jugular artery. Yeah? Habl Habl this. Now I was translating to English. The life artery. So it is here that some record is kept by God somehow. And that is not a record which we can discern and recognize. But of that we will speak tomorrow, inshallah. And before I come, you will translate it tomorrow, and then I will take up the matter from here and explain it further. Right? Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, inshallah, ma qalahu hadratuhu fi liqa al-yawm, fi liqa al-ghad, inshallah. Assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaykum.